What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Charm City Gamer here. Finally back with more My Rise after, well, this is, this is uh, recorded before all eight videos of my DM are up. Finally back with more My Rise for Miss Sky Omega. Let's jump back into her story. And for the glitch achievements, I have an idea. When we come to them, you guys know what they are. When we come to those achievements, what I'll do is I'll pick one. If the achievement goes off, I'll immediately duck out and pick the other one. And I'll do it and I'll duck out a third time and get the other one. Or I'll 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 pick one, duck out before, you know, it locks me into another something else. I'll pick one if the achieve pops, cool. Then I'll then I'll go to the dashboard and then grab the second one after I come back in. And then I'll duck out a third time go into the thing and play for a third time and pick the original option. This way I don't have to do the this way I don't have to do these two achieves um when I'm actually in my face character. I can just I can just do whatever on my heel side. Because if the things are glitched I don't want to really wait for them. Plus same thing with the heel with the uh, tag partner thing. That's neither here nor there. We got a ways to go before that, so we'll worry about that when we get there. As for the here comes the boom, apparently it's something Apparently for that one, it's not as lucky, because for that one, apparently, according to what I've read, you need a disc copy of the game, which I don't have. I got it digitally. You apparently can only get it with a disc copy, so for right now, I gotta wait till they fix that. Once they do, we can finally get it, and eventually, you want to print the game. But for now, let's chat with Miss Piper Niven, and see what we get here. Alright, so let's chat with Tom first, then Piper. LJ, welcome to SmackDown. How are you doing? I'm sorry that Survivor Series didn't go so well. Eh, we did what we could. Yeah, not the debut I was hoping for. I'm Mason. Well, you're here now, and have your whole career ahead of you. Listen, I may just be a cameraman, so I can't help train you, but I've been with WWE long enough that I pride myself on knowing how things work around here. Happy to answer any questions you might have. Thanks. How do I get a match, I'll just say. <laughs> How do I get a match? Well, you'll want to talk to Molly first so she can let you know what management has in mind for you. But generally, I've found that matches in WWE, whether they come from management or not, get booked in one of two ways. Talking to people or checking your social media messages. All right. Checking my social media? So you're saying I shouldn't try to go on a social media hiatus while I'm a WWE superstar? Heck no, why would you want to do that? Definitely not. Even a dinosaur like me relies on that instrument of the devil. If you don't check your social media, both the public feed and your direct messages, you might miss out on opportunities. Not everything there will lead to a match, but it's worth keeping up with what the WWE universe is up to. Okay, so check my social media feed and direct messages. Got it. And what did you mean by talking to people? I mean just that. Aside from being booked by management, you'll find that chatting with other superstars, the crew, or even other backstage visitors can lead to opportunities. Sometimes people might have favors to ask of you. Others might have bones to pick. You know how they say it's who you know? That's definitely true in WWE. Who you know, and who you talk to. Huh. Seems so easy. Yeah, it does seem easy, but it's probably not. It is. Don't try to put too much on your plate, though. You can always tell somebody who wants a favor no and come back to it later, or defuse a tense situation. But once you agree to something, you'll need to see it through. I was kind of afraid of that. <laughs> I was afraid that would be the case, but it's either here nor there, right? That's the key. I understand. So take it one thing at a time. That makes sense. Yep, Aruni. One thing at a time. Any other questions? Or anything you'd like me to explain again? Uh, what's good in catering? Mm, what would you recommend in catering? Honestly, the tofu. Even if you eat meat, give it a try. The seasoning is incredible. <laughs> All right, I'll keep that in mind. Noted. Any other questions? How do I improve my skills around here? It's just like the old saying goes, practice makes perfect. 
The more matches and experience you have in WWE... You said it's usually up to me what I want? Sure is. Occasionally... Okay, cool. Any other questions? No, I think I'm good. I think I'm good. Thanks, Tom. I think I have the info I need. Fantastic. Good luck tonight, LJ. I'm certain I'll see you around soon. Probably will. All right, Piper. Time to chat with the champ. Can't believe I'm saying those words, but she is the champion. I did not expect that for sure. All right, let's chat with the champ, Piper Niven. I'm not calling her Drew Drop, even though the name tag says that, because she's not Drew Drop anymore. She's Piper Niven. The game just came out. Bef um, the game just came out. You know, they already had her locked in as Drew Drop, so they couldn't change the name without. You get the point. Anyways, let's chat. Hey, welcome to SmackDown. Thanks, Piper. Thanks. You know, after what Liv said at Survivor Series, I wasn't sure if I'd be getting the warmest welcome today. Oh, you won't be. But I have a different perspective than the rest of the girls. In fact, I'm actually usually pretty rude to the newbies because, well, I don't want them coming for my SmackDown Women's Championship. But I don't have to worry about you at all. Um, that's a backhanded compliment. I want the title, but I do I want to build myself up, but I'm going to say I want the championship, so let's actually say I want to build myself up. My heel character will say she wants it right away, though. No. I'd like a championship someday, but I plan to put in the work and build myself up to that. <laughs> you're so funny! Someday, if your huge mistake at Survivor Series is any indication, I'll be in the Hall of Fame before you're even ready to think about challenging for the championship. Nothing to worry about here, so we can be friends. <laughs> oh, Piper, Piper, Piper. You are you are the queen of backhanded compliments right here. Damn. <laughs> I think we're done here. That is backhand compliment city. My gosh. <laughs> Molly, what's up? So, I know I didn't exactly get the best start, but I've got my head on straight now and I'm ready to go. That's great to hear. What do you have for me tonight? Now, here's something that's less great to hear. WWE management thinks that after everything that's happened, we should take a beat before we put the spotlight back on you. Take a beat? What's that mean? Don't worry. I'm not going to make the same mistake twice. But I need to redeem myself and show the WWE universe what I can really do. I need at least a little spotlight. I think you might have to settle for no spotlight. Backstage sentiment on you is not good right now. You may be a SmackDown superstar, but you've got an uphill battle if you actually want to be on the show. Oh, lovely. So my match tonight is... Non-existent. Ah. So let's say, what can I do with the heels? One will be like, why didn't you stick up on me? You know, because I'm Paige Platinum, blah, blah, blah. By the way, that's the name of my heel character when we... When we make that character, her name is Paige Platinum. Uh, big Time Paige Platinum. I wanted to go with Big Time Ruby Belize, but those weren't call names, so I decided to go with a different name instead. That's where Paige Platinum came in. What can I do? I don't want to just sit in catering. No one does. But this will all blow over. My advice until then? Find some way to make an impact. Be so good in the ring that they can't deny you. How am I supposed to do that if I can't get a match? I said I couldn't get you a match on SmackDown. There are other opportunities to wrestle. Actually, I can pull some strings and get you on main event. You'll need to find an opponent, though. Most of the roster is pretty busy with commitments on SmackDown, and I don't have time to play matchmaker. That's fine. Pretty busy or pretty mad at me, from the sound of it. Yeah, I may have heard those rumblings. Although... Have you met Ava Moreno yet? Oh, Jesus. She's pretty new to SmackDown, too, and also would have something to gain with a good showing on main event. 
Yeah, but I don't think she wants to touch me right now. We've met. I'm not sure she wants to work with me. Neither of you have to work with anyone. You just have to show up and fight each other. Get her to agree to that, and I'll set up the match. If there's some sort of beef between you two, lean into it. No one said the match had to be friendly. Well, thanks, Molly. That makes me feel so super better. Not. Now I gotta face the one girl on the roster that can't stand me. <laughs> Very well. Hold on, y'all. Okay, Ava Moreno. I don't like you. You don't like me. We want to we wanna get further up on SmackDown. We need to have a match, so let's go. Well, if it isn't little Justine, I would say I'm sorry how your big debut turned out, but I don't like to lie. What do you want? I feel like we got off on the wrong foot. What do I want? I just feel like maybe we got off on the wrong foot at Survivor Series. Tensions were high. I probably unintentionally insulted you. I just want to make amends. I bet we have more in common than you think. Needs, goals, that sort of thing. <sighs> you must really need something. <laughs> I was hoping we could help each other. Molly says she can get me a match on main event if I can find an opponent. After everything you said at Survivor Series, I thought of you. Are you interested? Sure. Great. That was actually easier than I thought. Oh, but let me be clear. I want a match on main event, but not one against you. I want to make an impact here in WWE and make my matches count. It doesn't help me at all to defeat some jobber. Oh, what did you just call me? If I wasn't perfectly clear at Survivor Series, I like people who've come up the right way and paid their dues, not nieces who get handed special treatment because of what family they're a part of. And if that wasn't enough, I certainly don't like you after you proved me right and made a mess of things. Regardless of what you think of me, I don't see how just sitting around and complaining is going to change anything. I know as well as you do that no one else in the locker room is going to help you. You want a match with me? Prove that you have what it takes when you have to work for an opportunity. Pay some dues and stop waltzing around expecting special treatment. I don't waltz. We can agree to disagree, LJ. Well, shit! <laughs> I can't even get a match with this brat. What now? <clears throat> I, uh, messed up. Well, gee, thanks, Justine. That really makes me feel better. Not! Guess there's no more things on the side there. That's all right, though. I don't mind it. <coughs> Unforgettable debut. That story is done. Yay. Molly. Storygate. Cora. Storygate. Ava. Let's chat. What do you want? I told you my terms. Doesn't seem like you've paid any dues at all. Well, that was a thing. Uh, I guess you can chat with Cora. I gotta face Cora in order to get. Let me see. Let me chat with Molly here first. I've got some good news for you. You've actually got a match for me this week. Actually, yes. 
Wow, I wasn't expecting that kind of good news. Thank you. Neither was I, really. I should clarify. It's not on SmackDown, but at a non-televised live event. Dana Brooke was supposed to have a match, but she did one too many handsprings, sprained her wrist, and can't compete this weekend. Hey, at least it's something. Match is a match. A match is a match. And if it helps me win a little favor around here to step up, count me in. Winning the match would help you gain even more favor. Okay, hold on a second before I do that. Let me get checked with Tamora. <coughs> Let me see if, if she has a different story. Probably the same thing, but let's see here. Hey, what's up? I was actually hoping to see you around here. Sounds like she did one of those uh, phoned in things like Edge did in 2K20. But maybe it's just my, maybe it's just the uh, uh, voice clip. I don't know. You were? Yeah, I loved watching old clips of your aunt on the network when I was growing up. But it was so cool when you debuted at Survivor Series and made it your own. I'm all about that. <sighs> Would have been cooler to win. What are you doing at SmackDown? NXT 2.0 doesn't take up enough of your time? Just doing some photo shoots and a little press. Honestly, it's been nice to be backstage at a show where I don't have to keep a lookout for toxic attraction. Not that I can't stand up for myself, but it's exhausting. Want some help? If you're offering, yeah. Honestly, I think they're just jealous. They may be hot and talented, but they could never do what I do. For one, they'd fall off the skateboard. You don't mind coming to NXT 2.0? Hang on a second. <clears throat> not at all. Not at all. It's not like I'm spread too thin with all my matches on SmackDown. NXT, okay. Whatever, I'll do it. If it'll let me. I think I can do that and the other one, so it doesn't really matter. So let's take it. We'll do a live event later. Let's take this one. Not like it was an optional match. So I'll head over to the 2.0 about Quora because she's a baby face. Can't hurt. Others probably did the other options, but I wanted to go there. <coughs> Here we go. Oh yeah, I forgot I have the cutest music. Skip the entrance when you see it. The following yeah. is a tag team match set for one fall. Introducing first, tag. from Madrid, Spain, the Latina sensation, Sky Omega! I get why she has a face model because she probably turned heel too late to get the generation. But it's nice to assist the generation. And her partner from Chicago, Illinois, Cora J. I I mean, I, I do like this one. I, prefer, I like Generation of J a little more. This is Generation of Jerry. Nice, fun, upbeat pace. Thing. So it's nice that I'll get it in this game. That's 
time. I'm gonna screw it myself. World work. You don't have to worry about it. You don't have to worry yourself about it. Aura? Yeah, there's no commentary on this match. That's interesting. The commentator the commentary is completely silent. From the top, baby! Let's get for us in action. That's kind of nice. Track the booty back in here, Jason. Oh, counter. Okay. Put like that spinning back fist. Calling for it. He's a con for it. <laughs> He's calling for it, folks. And there it is, Solar Eclipse. Thank you. 
Grenier with the shoulder. That's going to be hurting in the morning. Today, honey. Slice bread number two. Third one up. We go to the swamp time. Her to keep it down. There we go. And try to pin Gigi. If we can. Cover. Got it. Nice job, baby. Now, like I said, if that was my heel character, I would have the heel character basically wrestle the entire match. But Sky, she's friendly. She's she's gonna work with the other. She's gonna work with her tag team partner. All right, did the little tag match with Cora versus Toxic Attraction. Now it's time to see what Molly has in mind. Oh, Sammy's here. Hey, Sammy. <laughs> I respect the effort, but it's going to take a little bit more than that to get a match with me, LJ. Hey, at least she acknowledges I paid dues a little bit. <clears throat> Say hi to Sammy. Hold on here. For that, though, let's look at the app. Up, um, social media, quick. <laughs> okay, this chosen guy is a complete asshole. Oh, it was a non-TV match. Okay. No wonder there was no announcing. That was sweet. Thanks for the assist, Real at Real Sky Omega. Too bad that was a dark match. If that had been on TV, the WWE Universe would have loved it. Thanks, Cora. You're a sweetheart. At least in this game, you are. Not in real life anymore. In, in real life, Kayfabe, you're one of the meanest girls in NXT. Cap memories, I'll do that too. Why not? Gotta get all the all the other stories out of the way for the main story. I'm one of those guys who tried to get every story we can, you know. Gotta do them all because they only come up only come up once, well, once per run, of course. Let's mocap for the fictional WWE 2K24 melee. Oh, Fanny's here again. Hi, Fanny. Are you flying out for some exciting mocap action too? Sure am. I am. This is going to be awesome! Do you think they'll let us keep the funny suits? I hope so. Oh, man, I am such a big fan of your aunt. I always dreamed of getting in the ring with her. Sorry you have to settle for getting into the ring with me, I guess. Sure, but you'll be doing all her moves, so it'll be pretty close. Why would I be doing all her moves? Because you're doubling for her? Did nobody tell you? Awkward. Yeah, they want us to give them some new combinations of moves for classic superstars. Fans love playing as WWE legends. Don't worry, you're gonna make a great Justine. But I'm my own person. I don't want to make a great Justine. I want to make a great me. We may be related, but we are totally different wrestlers. I'm trying to establish myself as my own person, not just a copy of her. I hear you. I guess they just think there's no one in the world who's watched more Justine matches than you. 
so no one could do her moves as well. That's why they asked me to double my close personal friend, Trish Stratus. This is my hero character, I'm gonna cancel the flight. I get it, it's just not what I <coughs> thought I was signing up for. Don't worry, it'll be fun! We'll get out there, you'll hit a couple of Justine's classic moves, and everyone gets to go home happy. You'll make believe you're Justine, and I'll pretend I'm Trish. Maybe there's a love triangle. Or I just double-crossed you and cost you a championship shot. I don't know. We can workshop our backstory on the plane. Oh, Fanny. Oh, I missed her excitable self. <laughs> this is going to be a long flight. Head to the mocap set. One second. Alright, enough standing around. Let's go mocap for the fictional WWE 2K24, shall we? We could upgrade our character, but we're fine at 84, honestly. Alright, I'll upgrade our submission. Yeah, our submission's fine right there. Okay, so I'll upgrade our submission and running. That's fine. There she's 85. And now let's head to the mocap session. Alright, this should be fun. Let's do it. Let's smoke half a video game. <laughs> what time does the Myra crew get here? They're such a hassle to deal with. Oh, did I say that out loud? My bad. Friendly reminder to all talent and crew, please only use two squares of toilet paper. We have sensitive plumbing here. is the one for 2k20 yikes Oof. well excuse me i didn't realize i was I, I was hoping that wouldn't pop up but it's like eh. i was hoping i wouldn't hear that comment but apparently one trying to keep neely down wasn't the comment that Sheesh. Can you stay down for five minutes so i can actually do my move right you know what? Do whatever you want. Why am I even here? I know it's weird with no audience, but I don't know. Pretend this is WrestleMania at the Performance Center. You have to remind us of that? <laughs> Come on, mix it up a bit. You've already got enough footage of that move. I mean, not really. No one can look good in a mocap suit, but your moves look great. I gotta 
get booked on NBA. Dribble with your left hand, dribble with your right hand. Now shoot! So much easier than this. Pick up the pace a bit. If we go into OT, I'm in hot water. This is going to be great in the next game. I mean, we won't use a large portion of it, but keep it up. Whoever wins this match, dinner's on me. Well, technically it's on 2K since I'm expensing everything, but it's a thought that counts. Fuck's sake, hit the Moshka kick. You're looking sluggish. Taco Tuesday mocap lunch is always a bad idea. Don't worry, animation will fix all your mistakes. Okay, that with the musket kick, I'm gonna try something else. It ain't going through for some reason. X A A A, let's try that. This is taking so damn long. There, finally. That was a monster kick. I'll do that later. See, she always gets out of the way, see? Thank you for going under the ring yourself. Thank you. I was gonna have trouble getting one.
Let's hit the Justine Jammer for real this time. Got it. One, two. That's it. It's over. Hit the okay, that took longer than I planned, but we got it. Okay, that's all done. Now it's time for Molly. For real this time. Well, first I want to see Sammy. See if you ever changed your mind, Eddie. <laughs> yep. Alright, Sammy. What do you get to say, pal? Got some scoop. Let me do this one real fast, then we'll get, then we'll get, uh, Molly's done. I thought that was going to be the last free thing, but you never know all these extra stories. They're just adding and adding and adding. So, it's going to be a longer one then. I don't mind it. Add step through a character and a lot of other stuff. Alright, let's see what we can do. Geneva Road. Damn, we're going for the pin already. I don't think so, honey. Take the drop kick right to the face. I don't leave a mark, eh? One sec. All right, let's pour up, hit the morning sun, and end this thing. Morning sun. Good night, Jennifer. One, two. Oh, okay, maybe not good night. Let me hit another one real quick. Change my mind. I'll just hit her. I'll just pin her off the big elbow drop. Like I said, when I first made Sky Omega, she's like a, a wrestling Swiss Army knife. She can pin you and beat you off with any move. Oh, hi, Corey. I hope I didn't mess up the story by doing that. <laughs> I doubt it, but we'll see.
heard there was a little misunderstanding about mocap. Sorry, I should have been more clear. But the game doesn't really happen with the moves you capture for them. You can see more mocap in the future, and not just doubling to Justine. Let me take care of this. Looks like you were right about making a statement. That was a well-earned victory. No problem, Corey. I was happy to help. I'm just trying to show everyone what I'm capable of. Well, that was certainly a good start. How'd you like to give the trainers here another demonstration? Another one. What do you have in mind? Nikita Lyons, Caden Carter, and Zaya Lee are coming to the PC for a social media shoot. But I know they'd love to get in some ring time while they're here. Sounds good. I can hang out for another day or so. I'm sure there's a decent hotel nearby. Who am I facing? That's up to you. But you won't need a hotel. They'll be here any minute. You up for another match right now? Sure. I never turn down a match. I've been trying to get ring time for a while now, so I guess this must be my lucky day. Great. Who would you like to face? I'll take on Caden. I'll go up against Caden Carter. Sounds good. I'll let her know. See you out there. Because her styles are similar, and I don't know if she has anything to But if she does, I can show her with anything I have in my repertoire. To the match. See you guys there. Alright, let's take our Caden. She doesn't have resiliency. We're good. Let me just set up for the let me just get set up for the GG driver, hit it, and move on. Excuse me, the morning sun. All right, Caden, you put up a good fight. It is time for the morning sun and put you out. One, two, that's three, bell. That's three, bell. <laughs> Another one down. Try it out. Yeah, I didn't miss a little. Pretty good. If Justine, or er, uh, Justine, Ava's opinion on us changing. I had fun facing off against some strong competition in the PC today. Hashtag grinding. Newsflash. Real mega, real sky mega. No one watching means no one cares. A win is a win. Well, if it's a battle royal, I can do that. I'll be right back then. Hold on. The Justine Charity Battle Royal. Max up grade points three. We get a high school arena gym. Justine Battle Royal. Let's go for it. This is why you do all those side quests to get the hidden stuff. You never know what if you you never know what you can find. So you gotta go through all the you gotta do as much side questing as you can, otherwise you might miss something. Let's take care of this battle royal, shall we? You gotta beat a few poor schlarks, throw them over the top. Easy stuff. Ooh, this isn't pretty much over there. Thank you. 
That shots him. Shit. An exact shot that he shot here. That's to me. I know her music anyway. Loka. That means we throw out. And then the battle will. This is good to move. Not the present, but you can move. playing the wrong game, which the one of the two is the one that's just struggling to hang on to the top of my skin the end. I'm doing it. There we go. Okay, that's done. Maybe now I can finally get back to the main story. I know the vid's almost an hour. That's alright. You guys live for big content. You guys live for it, and I live to make it. Got three upgrade points and the arena. Nice. Okay. Now Drew's here. Ah, Sammy left. Bummer. Well, I heard you're making some waves lately. Waves in the kiddie pool, but waves nonetheless. Mm, maybe, but I didn't come to WWE to be in the kiddie pool. I have to talk to Sammy next time I, next time I go through. Didn't say that you did. Just like I didn't come to WWE to be pushed as the next big thing, only to be ultimately set aside and fired. Why did you bring up being fired? Is this supposed to be making me feel better? Sorry that way, but admittedly it took a turn. Sorry, I, I should have been more clear. I expected everything to be handed to me, but you're doing the work. Don't let up. Those waves you're making will be noticed. Thanks, Drew.
Sandy probably would have been a dick to me anyway. <laughs> okay, now we can finally move on to the main story. Which I think we'll do in the next video because it's already 56 minutes. So, till the next video, you guys know what to do. Follow me on Twitter at SpiderQueenAJ and Reborn Role Model for all your video updates, channel updates. And be sure to subscribe to us on YouTube, like our content. If you if you like our content, subscribe to us on YouTube at Charm City Gamer. See you all next time. Peace out, y'all.